Hello and welcome. Thanks for joining us. The show brings you Diamond Dynasty Baseball. It's the Detroit Tigers going up against the Bulls. First pitch. First pitch coming at you right after the break. And now, your 2022 Duro Bulls. So just about set. Victor Reyes a chance to hit the pitch. Leading off the afternoon for Detroit. That's a strike. And we're underway here this Detroit. afternoon. Reyes. First pitch. Next oh. offering in the dirt. And now it's even one and one. Is a 1 1. Swings through that one for strike two. Got him. One down. So digging in, Akil Badu. He's someone that really beats up on right handed pitching. The lefties, however, give him a little bit more trouble. No score just getting started, top of the first. Next offering is in for a strike. Nice warm day here. Good baseball weather. Does that change anything, Chris, especially for the hitters? Absolutely. You feel so much more comfortable at the plate. You're not worried about you know, getting jammed on fastballs inside part of the plate. Uh, you can kind of be more selective instead of just looking out away so that you can get the barrel to it in that part and get on the inside part of the plate as well. Two outs, space is empty. And yeah, the batter now, Javier Baez. This is another guy capable of hitting tape measure home runs. Brantley, ranging to his right, makes a nice running catch. And that'll do it. Bottom of the first, Luis Robert now. Leading off for Duro. The right fielder. The pitch. Luis. And it's fouled away. The wind of the pitch. And that one just missed off the outside edge. And that's outside. There's the swing and a miss. Well, he's ready for that fastball right there. Really turned on it, hit it hard, had the distance, but just too much hook to it. So might want to make a little bit of an adjustment, let it travel a little more, and see if you can keep that thing fair. And now it's filled up. Swing and a miss, struck him out, one away. Michael Brantley stands in. Batting second. No left fielder. Michael. In Brantley. there and it's 0 1. Brantley checks his swing, appeal to third, and he held up. The next pitch misses, and it's 2 and 1. Strike two. The next offering misses. Ball three. Still just the second batter of the inning, and on the mound, he's already thrown 13 pitches. They've got him working hard out there. Badu sizes this one up. Long run, nice grab. That's out number two. The batter now, nice Jorge Polanco. The second baseman. Jorge. And he swings and misses at the initial offering. Next pitch misses, and the count even one and one. So now one and two. Then he really sells the changeup with that arm action. 
pitch misses and it's two and two. Next offering upstairs. This to third. Sends it to first. And Polanco is out. And the inning is over. Back here at the ballpark. Austin Meadows now. Leading off for the Tiger. The left fielder. Austin Evaldi back to work. Fastball in for a strike. Strike one. <laughs> and a swing and a miss. And quickly one away in the second. And now it's that Jonathan is. Scope. The second baseman. Jonathan Scope. And that's in there for strike one. Oh, one's the count. Ball, Next good. pitch is downstairs. No score here in the second. Next oh. one misses two and one. On the ground to third. Slings it across. Oh. Two up, two down. This lineup's going to have to find a way to make him work a little harder out there on the mound. I mean, he is just mowing him down. He's settling in. You've got to make him uncomfortable. Maybe step out of the box, call timeout, do whatever it takes. And first offering is fouled off. Second inning here, no score. Next offering misses, and the count is one and two. One and two. And a swing and a miss, and that's that. Bottom of the second, and here's the first baseman, Jared Walsh. Leading off for the bull. The first baseman. And he deals. Jared. Strike one. He needs a quick one, two, three this time around. Last inning through a lot of pitches. Next offering is in for a strike. That fastball at the bottom of the zone can be very effective. Just got to keep it on the corners. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. And one out now. And here comes Sander Bogart. Sander Bogart. And first offering is fouled off. Bogarts, who wears that number two on his back for his idol, Derek Jeter. Next offering is fouled back. Next one misses. Now one and two. That one not close. Ball two. One down, base is empty. That one lifted to left. And that'll fall for a base hit. One down. And now it's going to be Jim Edmonds. Edmonds. The center fielder. Jim Edmonds. And a foul ball. Left hand hitter waits. And it's even up. Next offering is fouled back. Next one just misses. And the count is two and two. And a foul ball. He stays alive. And a pitch. And it's filled up. Good purpose pitch right there. Trying to tease him, get him to raise his sights, pop something up, and make it an easy out. Bogart's on the goal. Payoff pitch. Runner goes again. Now fly ball to right center. 
Reyes puts it away and there's two away. Here's Anthony Rendon up to the plate. Batting seven. The third baseman. Anthony Rendon. And that's ripped into left. Base hit. And that'll put runners at the corners with two away. First and third, two away. Digging batting in. Hit. Crash the Davis. Catcher. The switch yeah. hitter batting right. Davis. In the dirt. Next pitch misses outside. Two and one. That one in for a strike. Two and two. Bogarts on third. Rendon on at first with two down. Oh, now this one's high and deep. Way back there. On its way. Gone. So impressive how he was able to go down and get this fastball, but yet get it up in the air, get it far enough to get out of this ballpark. Nathan Evaldi now at the plate. Batting nine. The pitcher. Nathan. First pitch Evaldi. just misses. Next offering is in for a strike. Kicks and deals. And there's a foul ball. The pitch. Out there to center. Reyes coming on. Grabs it on the run. And that is the third out of the inning. Welcome back. Top half of the third inning. And now the first baseman, Leading Spencer the Torkelson. The first baseman. There's a strike. Well, after putting up a nice inning on offense, got some runs across, this is where you look for the starter to go out there, have a shutdown inning. Don't give that other team any hope. Uh, you just hope that he can get through this inning, get the bats back up there while they're hot. Eric Haas up now for the Tigers. Batting eight. The catcher, number 13, Eric. Oh. First pitch, and that's in for a strike. Next nope. offering is downstairs. And here it comes. And a big Double. swing and a miss. Runner at first with no outs here. <laughs> Got him looking. Now one away. Eduardo Rodriguez getting ready to hit. Eduardo. Maybe expecting a bunt here. Third baseman playing in on the edge of the grass. Trying to move him over here. Out as the pitcher does the job. Sack bunt executed perfectly. Victor now Reyes that. up now the for the Tigers. Field. He's Victor. 0 for 1. Nope. And the That's first that. pitch misses for ball one. Swing and a miss. One and two. Swing and a miss, and he struck him out. And he's down on strikes for the second time today. And welcome back. And now the right fielder, Luis Robert. Leading off for Durham. The right fielder. The wide to kick the pitch. Robert. Off the mark there. Ball one. Well, he's back out here for the third, and after the first couple of innings, pretty rough. I think the skipper's looking for him to give him a little bit of length, see if he can save the bullpen some. 2 0. 
Swing and a high fly ball down the left field line, but hooking foul. The next pitch misses, and now three and one. He swings and hits a fly ball, center field. Reyes settles under it, drops into the glove, and there's one down. Now Michael Brantley steps the in. Fielder, number 23, Michael Brantley. Swing and a line drive, base hit out of the center field. So a man aboard. Now it's the second baseman, now back, Jorge second Polanco. Baseman, Jorge. Oh, in there for strike one. Foul ball there. Brantley, the base runner at first with one out. And that one fouled off. Next pitch inside, and that's ball one. Kicks and fires. On the ground, could be two. On to scope. And it's a double play to end the inning. Start of the fourth. Here's a speed threat. Akil Badu. Leading off to the throw. The right fielder. Akil Badu. The wind of the pitch. Hey. Going one. On one. And that one wrapped foul. Ground ball left side, and it goes just foul. Owen oh, Chu now stays alive. The 0 2. That one ran inside, almost got him. The punch out there. Lead off hitter retired in the fourth. The batter down, Javier Baez. Javier Baez. And he swings and misses, and it's nothing in one. Started after the 0 1 pitch, and now a check down to first. And he went around, ruled a swing. Liner, base hit. Now he'll turn for second. Not stopping, he's going for three. And the tying runs aboard with a leadoff triple. Austin Meadows up now for the Tigers. He was a strikeout victim his first time. Rip to first, caught. And next to hit for Detroit, Jonathan Scope. And this is a big opportunity for him to pick up his teammate right here. That one's in there, 0 1. Rudder at third, two away. Next offering is in for a strike. Swing and a miss, and that is that. Bottom of the fourth, leading off, Jared Walsh. Leading off for the Bulls. The, the big lefty man. turns, kicks, Jared. deals. Upstairs. Just missed. Well, he looks more focused at the plate and working the count after that first at-bat strikeout. Next pitch misses, 
And now 3-0. and He hasn't fallen behind in the count like this all day. He's in danger of walking his first batter right here. Maybe a little loss of focus on the mound right there. Pretty much gifted him first base with a quick free pass. Here's Xander Bogart. Xander Bogart. Foul ball. And now the lefty just oh, off the outside down. part of the plate. When you look at Sander, he has all the tools to anchor a World Series lineup. Yeah, he's one of those rare talents. He's got power at the plate, discipline to go oh, along with it. Oh, and if he gets on, he's got the speed. This guy's a great combo, and he's an RBI machine. Rolled over to third. On the scope. And that's two. This is important. If he can go one, two, three here, it will be a very positive sign for him and for his team. Two outs, base is empty. And now Jim Edmonds. Good contact guy, good defender. Pulls that one foul. Oh, one down. Slapped foul. Two down, nobody on. That one misses. It's a ball and two strikes. Line drive. That's a base hit. Runner at first with two away. Now it's Anthony Rendon. The third baseman, Anthony. Next pitch downstairs. One and oh. And fouled off. Two outs. And that's in for a strike. And another ball. Great RBI spot here. Just got to stay focused on the pitch. The runner will be in motion, so something in the gap should definitely score it. Out in front and foul to the left side. Three and two now. Hit on the ground to Candelario. Rolls across the diamond. That's out number three. Here at the ballpark, we go to the top of the fifth. Now batting Jamer Candelario. The third baseman. Evaldi Jamer back to work. Candelario. Out to short. And he beats it. He's safe. And now Spencer Torkelson. And he's already singled in this game. Spencer Torkelson. In there, and it's 0-1. No, he's looking great so far. It helps with over 80% of your first pitches or strikes. He might be able to go the distance if he keeps this up. 0-2 as he waves at that one. Pitch misses there. And a count 1-2. and two. And a 1-2. To the right side. Can't glove it cleanly, but he wins the foot race to first. Good job of knowing how much time he had there. Well, that was clearly a double play ball, but now the bobble it. unfortunately yeah. prevented him from being yeah. able to get two. But a good job to stay oh. with it and make sure you got at least one. Diavaldi checks the runner. Candelario back on a dive. Swing and a line drive. Base hit out of the center field. Into third now. So runners at the corners and one out. Looks like it'll be a pinch hitter. Miguel Cabrera. One out, runners at the corners for Miguel Cabrera. Next offering is down low. And oh, that one, is no ball one. Nope, Next one down. misses two and oh. And the right-hander deals. And a foul ball. 
Makes the count two and one. And that one fouled off. The pitch. On the ground a second might be two. There's one and that's two. Back now to start the bottom of the fifth and taking over on the mound, Alex Lang. And his job is to collect quick outs and keep his team within striking distance. Well, at this point of the ball game, we're talking about middle innings and the little length out of this arm coming out of the bullpen. We'll see just how many outs he's able to give his skipper. 0-2 to Davis. Misses with the 2-0, and he's fired three straight outside the strike zone. Good plate appearance there. Able to take the walk. Well, that could be a tone setter for the inning. Four straight pitches and a leadoff batters on base. We'll see no if pitcher. the next guy waits until Take there's a called strike before he takes the bat off the shoulder. Devaldi in the box now. No balls and a strike. Here comes the pitch. Runner breaks for a second. And he pops up the bunt and puts the squeeze on that. And there's one down. Throw behind the runner. They've got him doubled off. So the batting order turns now over, batting. and right now it's Luis it. Robert. Louis. Robert. So You're now a pitch complete. hitter, Jesse pitch Winker, hitter. trying to get something Jesse. going for him with two away. Winker. That one is absolutely belted. Go! I love the approach as a pinch hitter right there. Don't let him steal a strike on you just because you're coming in cold off the bench. If you get something to handle, jump all over it. And he was on that one. That's a big boost to the dugout. Here's Michael Brantley. The left fielder, number 23, Michael Brantley. First pitch doesn't find the zone. Next offering is in for a strike. One and one. Next one is off the play and a count two and one. To the right side and there's a hit. Two outs runner at first. Here's the second baseman Jorge Polanco. Jorge Polanco. And that's in there for strike one. Right-hander kicks deals. And a foul ball. He stays alive. And he swings and lifts one to deep center field. That one back there. Pulls it in on the warning track. So remaining in the game defensively, Jesse Winker. He'll be the new right fielder after entering as a pinch hitter. All right, we go to the top half of inning number six. And now here's the speed threat. Outfielder, Victor Reyes. There's the strike. I'm impressed by the number of first pitch strikes. He's not afraid of contact. Some guys 
They'll nibble just because they don't want to get hit hard. That's not what we're seeing here. And there's one away. And up next for Detroit, Akil Badu. He's someone that you might not describe as having elite level speed, but he can absolutely move, and it is a factor in his game. This guy's definitely a plus runner, but what I love about him is that he goes all out every single time, never takes a break. It's guys like that, even though they don't have the elite speed, the fact that they're consistent with it, they make moves on the base paths. Walsh makes the catch. Two away. Now it's Javier Baez. The, Tigers, the shortstop, Javier Baez. First offering misses the mark. Yeah. Next offering is in for a strike. Well, on the mound, very efficient, able to produce an outcome, it seems like, within the third or fourth pitch of just about every at bat. And the righty deals. That's off the mark. Two balls, two strikes to count with two outs. Stays alive. Next offering misses, and that's ball three. Wow, this guy's really battling up there as if his run is the game winning run. I love his tenacity. In the air, out towards right center, and it gets by him. So two down, Austin Meadows now up now for the Tigers. Austin Meadows. The strategy of winning a ball game, when you can make that pitcher work a little more, expose himself by throwing pitches, that could be the key to winning perhaps later on. So Base hit, and a run comes in. So man aboard. And now here is Jonathan Scope. Second baseman, Jonathan Scope. Up the middle. Polanco tosses the first. And that is that. Ready to go for the last half of the inning. And here's the first baseman, Jared Walsh. The first baseman, Jared Walsh. Lang back to work. He swings and fouls one off. And a pitch. And a foul ball. He stays alive. Righty to the plate. Ball. And a ball evens the count. Oh, now this is blasted way back there on its way. Gone. He's so good at getting his arms extended, and that's exactly what he did right there. You don't typically want to pull a pitch in that part of the plate, but he doesn't allow his wrist to roll over, stays through the ball, gets the loft, and gets the home run. It's Xander Bogarts now. The batter, number two, shortstop, Xander. First Bogart. offering misses badly for ball one. Oh, he's just got to delete it. You give up that leadoff home run, go back to work, focus on this next batter. That one hammered center field, pretty well struck. Turning, looking, and that one is gone. 
Back to back jacks and this club is fired up right now Boog. I mean this is the kind of thing where you really start to notice hitters in a lineup feeding off each other and the collective confidence just continues to grow. New arm out of the bullpen Michael Fulmer. He's into the game with the bases empty. Michael Fulmer. And now Jim Edmonds. And now this one's a rocket to right. Way back there. Gone. Back to back to back home runs, and these guys look so dominant right now. A pitcher might want to check and see if he's tipping his pitches or not, but I tell you what, if this was basketball, that opposing team would call a timeout to try to slow down this offense. Anthony Rendon making his way the to the plate. Basement, number six, Anthony Rendon. And yeah, the first oh, offering is right. not close. Wings here and blasts one left field, and it's gone. Wow, four consecutive home runs. These guys are taking batting practice in the game. Just unbelievable at bats, and I tell you what, that hitting coach over there in the dugout, he's feeling pretty proud of himself right now. And here's the catcher, Crash the catcher, Davis. Number eight, Crash Davis. First pitch, and he just misses. High in the air, out to right. Badu moving under it. And out number one on the grab. Next to hit, Nathan Evaldi. The pitcher, number 17, Nathan Evaldi. So a pinch hitter in the pitcher spot, George Brett. I remember when all the eyes in baseball were on Brett as he chased the magic 400 mark in 1980. Didn't miss by much, finished at 390. Next offering is in for a strike. Got him. Down on strikes, and he knew it. Here's Jesse Winker. He's already homered here in this one. And first offering is fouled off. Left hand batter waits. That one ripped. And Winker is set down. And that ends the inning. Jonathan Loisica into the game. And he's got a nice lead to work with. We go to the top of the seventh. And now, Jamer Candelario. And a pitch. And he pumps in a strike. The third baseman, Jamer Candelario. In the air, left field, down the line, and now maybe extra bases. And that's going to kick into the corner. Safe at second with a leadoff double. Next to hit, Spencer no Torkelson. Spencer Torkelson. Well, the leadoff man gets on. You want to minimize the threat by playing sound defense. Hopefully the pitcher can get a ball on the ground and they can roll him up for two. Right-handed reliever. Aye. Candelario leads off second with nobody out. Swing and a bouncer. Tosses the first, oh. and they get Torkelson for the out. Eric Haas up now for the Tigers. The catcher, number 13, Eric Haas. And it's fouled away. One away with a runner at third. Next offering is in for a strike. And a swing and a miss. Out number two. So now a pinch hitter for the pitcher, Robbie Grossman, looking for a two-out hit to bring home the runner from third. First pitch just misses. Line to left. Brantley makes the catch, and that'll do it.
Kyle Funkhouse on a pitch out of the pen here. He comes in with his team trailing by a bunch, so he'll try to keep it where it is. Welcome back. Bottom of the seventh. Michael Brantley to start things off. The left fielder, Michael. First offering, and it just misses. And it's one and one. Here comes the pitch. Just off the inside edge. Boog, he never moved because he never had time to. But that kind of velocity, you prefer that pitcher work away. Hit well. Right field way back and gone. Anytime you have a pitch down the middle of the plate, the percentages go up for the hitter to do damage, even if it's a pretty good sinker like that one. Nice piece of hitting there at the plate. And now it's the switch hitting second baseman, Jorge Polanco. Now batting second baseman, Jorge Polanco. And the first pitch misses for ball one. Part of the order coming through now, and with one home run already in this inning, they're definitely looking to do some more damage. Torkelson collects. Torkelson takes it himself and one away in the bottom of the seventh. Stepping in, Jared Walsh. First baseman, Jared Walsh. First pitch, and he just misses. That's a good miss off the inside part of the plate. You'd much rather miss there than out over the plate where this guy could do some real damage. And that's downstairs and outside. Fouled off to the right. Up the middle, Baez handles. Tosses to first, Walsh retired. Good sinker low in the zone right there and produced exactly what he was no looking matter. for. Ball on the ground, nice first ground out. Time. Andrew Bogart stands in with two away as he takes a ball. Next pitch is outside. He's clearly trying to work him away here. Both pitches off the plate. If you really want to put the ball in play, you're going to have to stay back and drive it to the opposite field. The pitch. And now it's filled up. And a swing and a miss. Down on strikes. Xander Bogart's a little frustrated. And welcome back. We're at the top of the eighth. And stepping in is the court. speedy Victor Reyes. Victor Reyes. And a foul ball. And he's down 0 2 as he swings through it. Oh, and 2 now. Good eye right there. On the ground. A great play deep in the hole. Oh, a well thrown slider like that one can be tough to get in the air. Good downward break on that one. Now back. So up next, Akil Badu. Badu. First offering misses the mark. Next pitch downstairs, and it's 2 and 0. Oh. Righty delivers. And strike two. Well, you got to find a way to catch up to that pitch. Perhaps shorten the swing, eliminate the stride. That one came in hot, but right down the middle, you're saying to yourself, how did I miss that pitch? Got to make a quick adjustment. Hammered on a line at a left base hit. Takes the turn. He's digging for second. And that's a two bagger. Javier Baez up now for the Tigers. Now batter, the shortstop. Javier. And first offering is fouled off. 
And it's second. Swings and misses. And that is strike two. Next offering is down low. Badu, the runner at second with one away. Next pitch has popped up. Baez gone on the play. Two down. Here is Austin Meadows. Now batting left fielder Austin Meadows. Swings through that one. 0 oh, and 1. Comes up empty on the swing. 0 oh, and 2 now. Just not able to catch up to that velocity. Next offering upstairs. Too close for me, partner, to take that 0-2 fastball, but for whatever. Now ah, that's strike three and the third out. So we take a break. Back here at the ballpark, out of the bottom of the eighth. Here's the center fielder, Jim Edmonds. The center fielder, Jim Edmonds. Right hander back to work. Just missed. And that one almost got him. And the pitch. And downstairs. Next pitch in for a strike, three and one. And the 3-1. And there's a foul ball. Fouled off again. And it remains 3-2. and two. And he walked him. Good miss by Mutz right there. Just couldn't get the call off the inside corner. Here's the third baseman, Anthony Rendell. Third baseman, Anthony Rendell. First pitch doesn't find the zone. Next offering is in for a strike.
and a pitch. And that one gets past the catcher. Nobody out. Runner at first. Swing and a miss, and now two and two. Wow, no fair right there. I mean, that slider didn't move to the very last moment. Incredibly difficult to pick that up. Just kind of this one squared up down the left field line. If it's fair, it's gone. It's fair, and it is gone. Knew what pitch he wanted to hit. Spit on some other pitches in this hit. Bad was very patient, and it paid off. Gregory Soto gets the call from the pen. He's being eased into the game here with the bases empty. Crash Davis digs in now. And he hits a ground ball right side. And that one finds its way through. And at first, Jonathan Loisica, the next to hit. Jonathan Loisica. So they're making a move for a bat off the bench. Ricky Henderson, a runner at first for him, nobody out. And the first pitch misses for ball one. Runner takes off in the dirt. Davis at second with nobody out. Next offering is in for a strike. Popped up to the left. Into foul ground. Haas on his way over. One down. So the lineup flips over. Now it's the right fielder, Jesse Winker. The right fielder, Jesse Winker. Now a move being made for a pinch hitter, Kyle Tucker. He gets a chance with a runner in scoring position and one gone. First offering misses the mark. Next pitch is outside. One out and a runner at second. Next offering is foul back. pitch next offer misses down and away swing and a miss three and two now gonna really need to hang in there with that front side against this left-handed breaking ball and down on strikes and there are two outs and Michael Brantley is going to come up to no him. No matter what, Michael. you're playing this kind Brantley. of rival. Take your game to another level. Meadows moving back for this one. Pulls it in on the run. That is the inning. Staying in the game on defense, Kyle Tucker. He'll be the new right fielder after entering as a pinch hitter. Here comes Emmanuel Classe out of the bullpen. He has a great slider with tons of movement. Sko, batting with one down, takes the strike. Rip to third. A dive. He's got it. Got it. Great play to keep the leadoff man off base. Chad like reflexes on that one makes the dive has to get up clean exchange to throw a strike across the diamond and what a tremendous play. Jamer Candelario up now for the Tigers. And he swings and misses at the initial offering. Oh and two as he waves at that one. Oh and two now. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. Two gone. Spencer Torkelson now, now at the plate. The One for three. Spencer Torkelson. 
Intentional walk coming here. They put him on board, and with two outs, they'll go after the next bat. Who do you think you could draw a walk in the bigs if we gave you enough at-bats? Oh, that's a good question. Um, I think that if they gave the pitcher a full scouting report on me, yes, I think I could draw a walk. Just one out away, trying to close it out. And a swing and a miss, and that is the ball game. An 11-1 final. For Chris Singleton and our entire crew here at MLB The Show, thanks for stopping by. I'm John Chambi. Talk to you soon.